Welcome to the official online channel of the Royal Tyrrell Museum, where the only constant of life on Earth is change. An elasmosaur is uh, a type of marine reptile. It's not a dinosaur, but it's probably more closely related to lizards and snakes. This specimen is significant because it's the largest marine reptile found in Alberta, and it's also complete elasmosaurs are quite rare. Here we have the specimen still in its original field jacket. In this jacket, we have the base of the neck with vertebrae running this way that connects onto a, another jacket that has the middle of the neck. Here we have two sections of the front part of the neck, both of them running that way. Here we have parts of the shoulder region, the scapula and the clavicle. Here we have an articulated flipper, ribs, and a number of disarticulated flipper elements. This specimen will take approximately about a year and a half to prepare. That's with uh, three technicians working on it. During the last few million years of the age of dinosaurs, Alberta was covered in large part by a shallow sea. This seaway ran all the way from the Gulf of Mexico up to uh, the Arctic Ocean. And the, we find sed uh, rock, sedimentary rocks that show that this was marine conditions. There was clams and oysters and uh, types of shelled squid swimming in the same waters with this elasmosaur. The only way we found this specimen was that miners working at the Corite Amylite mine uh, happened to uncover the bones. If it wasn't for them and their excavations in their mine area, this specimen would, wouldn't have seen the light for many thousands of years possibly. For more information, please visit our website at www.tyrrellmuseum.com.